Hi guys, this is lesson number 55 from our Coral Draw Training Course series. In this exercise, we are going to learn how to create this beautiful realistic wooden frame using texture fill in Coral Draw. Texture fill under interactive fill we can find. If I will click on interactive fill tool. Here we have uh, uniform fill, we have fountain fill and in the front here we have texture fill. If I will click on texture fill, in front of texture there is a samples. If I will click on this drop down, we have different samples. Any sample we can click to see the textures in the front here. Now samples it is selected and from this category I can choose any of the texture from here. I can click on this fill picker drop down and there is a lot of texture. But most of the time we are not using this texture. There is a lot of texture, beautiful design through internet we can download and we can add in our layouts in our design. But still some of the texture from these categories are useful. In this lesson we are going to use this texture that is uh, wood texture and using this texture we will create picture frame. So let's get started. The first thing we are going to draw a frame. It is simple we will go to the rectangle tool and simply click on drag to draw one rectangular shape. Go to drop shadow and here we have another tool that is contour tool. This tool we are going to use for offset. Click and drag. This is how we have inside. We are not going to do anything with this. We are not going to break it or add it. Simply we will create the corner by using freehand tool. Click on freehand tool. And this way we can create corner. Now we will use smart fill tool to get the both sides. Orange color is selected. It's okay. Just click. So this is how we got our desired shape from both sides. Now click on pick tool, press delete. Let's select the first object, go to interactive fill, then click on texture. And from here we are going to choose this texture. Click it. You can see that my object, it's got white color. Now we need to click and drag to apply that texture. So simply click and drag by pressing control key. So the texture has been applied. To expand from left to right, we will click on this small square and drag it. Press control key so it will maintain the alignment. Here we can stretch also. If we want to reposition from this control, we can just move it. Okay, that is fine. Let's change the color. Here we have button edit fill. Click on edit fill. Under edit fill, we have two color, first color and second color. Click on the first color and let's choose some dark color. Close it. And the second color, we can take some light. Okay, that is fine. Close this uh, color picker, then click OK. So this is how the texture has been filled. Now the second thing, here we have one control. This is very important, transform with object. Once you will scale this picture frame, the texture will remain small. So for this reason, we need to click on this button, transform with object. This time when you will enlarge, you will make it big, your picture frame. This wooden texture will be resized accordingly. Let's apply to this object, select it, go to copy fill. We are still under interactive fill tool and simply click on the texture we filled already. Now here we have issue the texture direction. We need to make it vertically. So simply click and drag this way by pressing control key and stretch it vertically. From here we can reposition, press control key. Okay, that is fine. Since we copy the fill, you can see here the transform with object so that is fine. Click on pick tool. Simply select both objects. Press plus key from the numeric keyboard from the right side of your keyboard. Simply click on horizontal mirror and then mirror vertically. This is how we created this beautiful wooden frame by using texture fill. Here I have already image I can duplicate by pressing plus key. That's all. It's already in the back. So this is how we created this beautiful wooden frame with the 
few easy steps. That's all for now. I hope you enjoy this lesson and try to practice. Guys, if you like my video, please subscribe my channel and click on the bell button so you will always get notification once I will upload new video. Thank you.